Hello everybody, it's your Tar Plug here, and today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to pick up and handle a scorpion. So what you're going to need to pick up your scorpion is obviously the scorpion itself and some tweezers. Uh, there's a lot of different ways to pick up scorpions, but the way I recommend uh, uses tweezers. So. Uh, I guess that's really all you need to know. So, um, I made a video a little while ago about how to pick up a tarantula, and I asked you guys if I should make a video on how to pick up a scorpion, and most of you guys said I should, so that's what I'm going to do today. And without further ado, let's get started. So, what you're going to want to do is just open up the cage with the scorpion in it. I have an Asian forest scorpion and you're gonna just wanna remove a lot of the stuff from the cage just like what we did with the uh, tarantula just to make sure that they can't go on run under any hides whenever you're gonna be picking them up. So there's Fluffy, he is my Asian forest scorpion and we're just gonna kinda go ahead and get started so you might wanna tap them a little bit with the tweezers just so to make sure that they're not asleep and you don't just freak them out whenever you pick them up. So what you're gonna wanna do is just kinda go on either side of the stinger and grab it with the tweezers. Now just, you can kinda lift them up like this and you can see the stinger. And they might open their claws or something, but they're probably not gonna pinch you. But pinching isn't that bad. It's a stinger you really wanna worry about. So then you can just kinda plop them down in your hand and you can just let them walk around hand from hand if you want pretty much how we did with the tarantula. The only difference is really just how you pick them up. Then when you're ready to put them back, just grab them on either side of the stinger again, pull them off of you, just set them back down in their cage. So there you have it. It's pretty straightforward on how to pick up a scorpion. Of course, the kind of scorpion I have is an Asian forest scorpion. So if you're looking into getting a scorpion, I would always recommend an emperor scorpion for beginners. Uh, I have an Asian forest scorpion. They're pretty similar to emperor scorpions, except they're just a little bit more aggressive. Now, they're both pretty docile and pretty hardy and easy to care for. So that's going to be about it for today, guys. I will see you all next time. Remember to like that like button, subscribe, and comment for a chance to be pinned. See you guys all next time. And yeah, that's it for today. Bye. Crazy mother.